See that glass break? Of course, because we hit the right frequency. Yeah, man. We better remember that last chord. It's heavy. How do you like my new group at Futura? Oh, it's wonderful. You and Ray and Tempo are the best rock group in the galaxy. That's why we call ourselves Future Rock. We're just about to take off for a very important concert on Spectre. Uh, Spectre? That's a ghost planet and a very dangerous place. Why would anyone want a rock group to play there? I guess they heard we were good. And you know what? I got the job by myself and... Oh, I'm sorry, Laser. When your parents went on vacation, I promised to take care of you as though you were my own child. But at Futura... And ghost planets are too dangerous. I just can't let you go to Spectre. Oh, now we can't go. Oh, uh, yes, we will, Ray. Yes, we will. Jake! Jake! What? Ow! Trace, hold it down for a minute! What'd you say? I just wanted you to hear Tracy's drama. Hear it? I haven't heard anything else for the last two weeks. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, it's okay, Trace. I, I didn't mean it. I, I love your drumming. Yeah, play some more rock and roll. Laser! Laser, where are you? Where could they have gone? Laser said they'd be practicing for hours. That's Laser's rocket, and it's headed for Planet Spectre. He's going to do the concert even after I told him not to. Jake, look! Now what? Hi, guys. Oh, uh, sorry about the noise. Uh, how are you, Futura? I'm fine. Or I should say I was fine until a little while ago. Wow, what happened? It's my nephew, Laser. I'm afraid he may be getting himself in some serious trouble. Check it out. Spectre's a scary-looking kind of place, isn't it? Oh, uh, it's just a little dark. In an hour or so, it'll be full of kids. I hope you're right. Well, you broke your Aunt Futura's rules when you brought us here, so this concert better be, uh, worth it. Trust me. Now, come on. Let's get our stuff inside. So, that's about it. I'm sure his rocket was heading in the direction of Planet Spectre. Oh, it may be hard to rescue them from there. Will you help me? Okie dokie. You bet. Come on, let's suit up. Wow. 
Pokemon Rescue coming up. Let's go! Let's go! doesn't go on a diet, I'm going on a strike. <laughs> Looks as though I'm going to make the load even heavier, GB. <laughs> what? You, Futura? Heavier? Never. Carrying you is like carrying a feather or wearing a silk scarf or... Enough, GB. We've got work to do. Can we switch on the time turbo? It still looks scary to me. Yeah, me too. <laughs> if they think they're scared now, just wait until I get them in my maze. Bug droids, make sure future rockets to the center stage of my ghost tunnel. Then lock them up. <laughs> Good. My plan is working now. When Future's nephew is in my hands, she will come to his rescue, and then... <laughs> I'll put her in the ghost tunnels, where she'll be lost forever. Ah, uh, GV, don't worry. We're almost there. Can't be soon enough for me. Hmm. When is the audience gonna get here? Pretty soon, I guess. Let's play a few bars and check out the microphones. Here goes. One, two, three, four. the audience now. Doesn't sound like people to me. Maybe not, but what is it? Phew, I didn't think I was gonna make it. <laughs> why does the gorilla have to drive? I ask you, why? Who ever heard of a gorilla? Driving. There's Laser's ship. This must be the place where his group is playing. But I don't see any people. You're right, Futura. I don't like the look of this. Neither do I. Let's check it out. Okay, <laughs> okay. Whoa! Well, what is it? What's going on? I don't know. Uh, 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 I do. Oh, robots! And they look like giant bugs. Maybe they're part of the audience. Or maybe not. Hey, that's my best speaker. Let's see how they like this song. <laughs> Yeah, try dancing to this beat. Blast! Those useless Bactroids! I have to do everything myself! Hey, like, there's too many of them! They haven't got us yet! I... It's a freeze beam, ah, and it's got us. And so have those barks. Look, 
That blue light. It's a freeze beam. Laser's in trouble. We've got to help him. <laughs> Blue glow is a freeze beam. Laser and Ray and Tempo must have been drawn into a trap. Then it's up to us to get them out of it. Let's go. Ugh, those robots are really ugly. Now what are they up to? It's a lab. We'll try. Now what? You'll find out soon enough, my friend. Major Rat! What's that? Ugh! Haven't seen anything that big since the last time we went whale watching. <laughs> There's nothing to laugh about, Lather. You're nothing more than bait to trap my enemy, your Aunt Futura. What's that? Here they come. <laughs> good, good. Futura and the Ghostbusters. My trap is working even better than I had hoped for. <laughs> Watch as I throw them into my ghost tunnels where they can wander through the dark passages in fear. <laughs> Forever. <laughs> I sure wish we didn't have to bust ghosts in the dark so much. Sorry about that, Eddie. But... Whoa! Whoa! Suffering spirits, what is this place? I'm afraid I know what it is. No, oh, I don't like the sound of that word, uh, afraid. We've fallen into Corpulon's endless tunnels. Did you say <laughs> endless tunnels? Yes, and they're filled with ghosts. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, no! But who is Corpulon? A mean and vicious ghost. I sent him into limbo years ago, but it looks as though he's back. And he tricked Laser into coming here. But why? Because he wants to get even with me. Don't worry, Futura. We'll find Laser, and we'll stop Corpulon, too. If there's a way in here, then there's a way out. Let's start there. Very good. Very good. The Ghostbusters and Futura are lost in my ghost tunnel. <laughs> Fools! I want you to keep my food jug full. I can't survive without energy! <laughs> Nice guy, huh? Sure, if you want to talk. Fine. Now, it's time to pay Futura back for putting me in ghost limbo. Tracy, stay close to me. No problem. Yeah, I, I didn't mean that close. That's better. Trace, I told you not to walk so close. Trace, cut it off! <laughs> Monster! Tra Tracy! <laughs> <laughs> Sure, I'll get the first one, you get the other. Let's go! Wow, that was some dance. Are you guys okay? Sure, but what's next in this place? I don't know. We've just got to keep trying to find Corpulon. Let's get going. Okay, okay. Corpulon uses a tremendous amount of energy. He actually eats it. If we had some kind of detector, we could track him down. What do you think, Trace? Can you throw something together? Perhaps. Ooh, how grody! He's been eating non-stop! Yeah, and have you 
noticed how his body glows when he eats? That's right. It does. But why? Must be some kind of energy. And he gets it from those big jugs. There. I wish I could smash them. Maybe he'd lose his power. Perhaps you could find the right frequency. That's it, Tempo. Let's get our instruments. We're gonna find the quartz that will smash our disgusting friend's energy jugs. There it is. That's great, Trace. Switch it on. <gasps> it's working. It should lead us directly to the center of the tunnels and Corpulon. Let's go, Ghostbusters! <laughs> What are you doing there? Stop that! <sighs> Make them stop playing. I hate rock and roll music. That's it, guys. We found it. Stop them! Stop them! They're destroying my energy food! It's working! Hit it again! Let's aim the music at the cocoon. Maybe it'll break through. Now! Far out! Come on, let's grab him. Fools! You'll pay for this insolence. Watch this. All my power is now in the energy jugs. In five minutes, it will explode, and the caves will be filled in. It'll take you years to find your way out. <laughs> then I'll return, and the 30th century will be mine. <laughs> oh, you think it's true? I'm afraid so. Look at the way those energy jugs are glowing. Laser, thank goodness you're safe. And Futura! How did you find us? Tracy's trusty energy detector let us in. In a few minutes, this whole place is gonna blow up and keep us locked in here. That's right. Well, well, what are we gonna do? Trace, looks like we have to call on you again. Okay, okay. Now, Tracy, it's gonna blow! Alright! We did it! Alright! <laughs> you know, you never should have gone to Planet Spectre without my permission, Laser. I know, Aunt Futura. It was foolish, and I'll never do it again. But we did find out something important. What's that? Well, our music has amazing powers. We use it to smash those energy jugs and break out of the cocoon. And I'll bet we could do even more than that, man. Yeah, we could help you fight ghosts, Aunt Futura. Hmm, it's a possibility. But for right now, how about some 30th century rock and roll? I know somebody who can't wait to sit in with you guys. Good idea. Here we go, Tracy. A one, two, three, four. All right. Laser was very foolish to go to the ghost planet without telling Futura where he was going. Yeah, especially after she told him not to go. He and his friends were lucky that the Ghostbusters and Futura rescued them. But if you go somewhere without telling your parents where you're going, you might not be so lucky. So remember, never go anywhere until you let your parents know where you'll be and how long you're going to be there, okay? Bye.